let's expand our horizons, shall we? Let your mental walls dissolve and float away. Hey, you only have one wing, and I'm defective. I guess that makes us both outcasts. My eye! Hey! Theo, you must be here to replace me as supreme cosmic deity of this reality. Let's see if you're worthy. Cartoon Network Journeys VR. Welcome, fellow traveler. I'm Gormlorm, the gateway guru, but you can just call me Gorm. I sense that you come here seeking self-knowledge. Place this card in the fire and let's be off. You can't start your journey without feeding the flame. It's been said that a thousand mile journey starts with one step. In this case, that step is burning that card. Just burn that book if you ever want to start your journey from the beginning. You can't start your journey without feeding the flame. It's been said that a thousand mile journey starts with one step. In this case, that step is burning that card. That's the gate. Throw it into the fire if you're ready to leave for good. Whoa, meta, right on. You can't start your journey without feeding the flame. Let's expand our horizons, shall we? Let your mental walls dissolve and float away. The multiverse consists of an infinite number of dimensions, each with their own lessons to teach us. I've spent my life visiting them before my extended pit stop here. The knowledge you seek is in these worlds. The direction you take is up to you. Do you want to commune with nature and see the world from a different perspective? Uh, maybe the musical and performing arts are more your thing. Who doesn't love a captive audience? Or maybe you want something more. Cosmic and abstract. The decision is yours. Place your choice in the fire. <laughs> nah, too many rings. Hmm, gaseous. I like that. Low gravity? I can get into that. to do with the card, right? Burn, baby, burn. Yeah, I have green skin. I love it. I love having green skin. Four fingers. You know, you guys have five fingers, I get it. But uh, all you need is four, really. Uh, they're really strong. They're a lot stronger than your, your fingers, so 
Excellent pick. I'm buzzing with excitement. Tell Big Papa I said hello. Nikita, do you have the answer? No? Uh. Anyway, the answer is one. One week left before this nectar shortage causes our colony to collapse. I know you're the only one winged bee in the colony, but you still need to help. Nikita! Nikita! Huh? What the? Don't be afraid. I'm speaking to you from another realm. Your service is needed. The legends tell of a special bee, unlike any other, who will save the hive by discovering the lost city of Nectar. Nikita, with your single wing, you may be that special bee. You may only have one wing, but you can still hop. You must hurry, Nikita. Don't be afraid. Nikita, are you in there? Open up! Come on now. I don't have much. 
how much time. now. Open up. Nikita. Nikita. Ah, there you are, Nikita. I know you've only got one wing and can't fly like the other bees. But this is an emergency, and everyone needs to pitch in. Now what I need from you is to take this defective pollen back to the pollen silo for recycling. Easy Hi, enough, right? I'm Penny. Now stick the pollen to your chest so you don't lose it on your way to the recycling silo. Great! Some of these clovers might need a little nudge, though. I'll get the first one for you. All right, move along now. Get to that pond silo and stay away from the construction zone. Hey, you only have one wing and I'm defective. I guess that makes us both outcasts. I think you need to throw me at that glowing piece on the clover. Hello there, young one. If you're looking for the pollen silo, it's just down that clover path. Hey, put me on your chest. Clover made me feel useful. Let's do it again. Oh my god, let's go, let's go. We gotta go, we gotta go, we gotta go. Oh my god, I'm so late, I'm so late, I'm so That hive is in bad shape. So we're headed to the recycling silo, huh? I guess it was inevitable. I think it's just down that path. I always knew I'd be destined for recycling, but maybe I can help the colony a little first? Hey there! One wing! If you're thinking of taking that pollen to the recycling silo, that path is closed. Get a load of these two oddballs. 
you two make a great team. <laughs> Don't even think about entering the construction area. It's dangerous, especially for a bee that can't fly. Stay away, you hear? be in this area. It's kind of scary, but exciting too. Wait, hold on. Do you feel something? I thought I felt... Whoa. 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 Something about this place is really exciting. Well, hello there, you one winged cutie. Are you looking for the flower temple? Maybe that pollen phyllo can wait a bit. Slug. I'm not a slug. Can, can't you see I have a have a have a shell? Hey, what are you doing down here, huh? I've never seen any bee roaming around these parts. This is a pretty funny looking pollen silo. It says this temple is the first step on the road to the lost city of Nectar. Only unique individuals may pass. We're unique, right? Those symbols are lighting up too. Hey, we're going inside, right? Let's just check it out for a sec. Then you can bring me back to the silo. Hey, put me on your chest. Ooh, that keyhole is calling to me. You've got to put me in there. Just being in here feels special. Ooh, I feel like we're onto something here. Hmm, this is interesting. Some kind of puzzle.
recording. Keep going. Nice work. Well, I've got kind of a good feeling about this place. This is my favorite place I have ever been. Yes, we're so close. Yes, yes. Look, he's beautiful. Hmm, it looks like he's hungry. Good work, young bee. You've conquered the first flower temple and are one step closer to unlocking the mega flower where nectar flows without limit but only the worthy are needed you'll need the friends you've made and many more to solve the traps and puzzles you'll find along the way good luck young bee and farewell look i found another pollen inside Hey, thanks for getting me out of there. I've been stuck in that head for a thousand years. Now let's hurry up and get to breaking things. I like to break things. Boom! Check it out! The nectar is flowing! Let's keep breaking things! Try the other guy. Boom. Boom. Are we headed to the Lost City? I hope there's things to break there. Well, I hope we meet more new pawns like you, Ron. You've helped us so much already. Wow! That must be it in the distance. The Lost City of Nectar. It's beautiful! Yeah, and it looks like there's more temples along the way. 
don't worry, Ron. I'm sure we'll find all kinds of things to break along the way. Yeah, I like to break things. Welcome back! How's old Papa B doing? to do with the card, right? Burn, baby, burn. A choice fit for a king. The king is kind and generous until he gets the blues. To stop the odds is our job to keep the king amused. For if the king is not amused, his face will turn to red. And should he lose his temper, you will surely lose your head. You must gather all your wits to amuse the king to bits. Use the things that you can see to keep the king from misery. If your action doesn't work, change it quickly or be cursed. We must amuse the king. We must amuse the king. So use your head and choose a thing. We must amuse the king. We must amuse the king. The king is kind and generous until he gets the blues. Fine people of Jester Death, introducing our 100th Jester of the Day, put right here on the spot for the sole purpose of your amusement. Don't worry, I'm sure you won't die horribly like the last 99. Just uh, try to do something amusing. Does anyone have anything to throw? I <laughs> oh yeah, that's a new one. Looks delicious. Hope the jester doesn't waste it. You have made a heinous crime nobody can defend. Attacking the king is a terrible thing. Prepare to meet your end.
One more jest is here, my lord, to keep the king from getting bored. If they're not a hit, they will end up in the pit. <laughs> I suppose dessert is on you. <laughs> now that is some grey egg whipping. I heard the king likes it when the jester does something that's actually entertaining. Well, I heard the king likes his toes some. Shut up, Gary. Who asked you? Well, I want to hear about what the king likes. No one asked you either. Enough with the peanut gallery. Wait, 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 wait. Is this a joke? Guys, why are we cheering for this? Are we so easily impressed by someone just because they're wearing a funny hat? Where's your taste? Your dignity? We used to be a crowd who demanded only the finest entertainment the kingdom had to offer. In fact, I bet any one of us could stand up there and do the exact same thing. Heck, the only legitimately entertaining thing about this sad excuse for a performance is when one of the jesters messes up big time and gets fed to the dragon. Honestly now, if that's all we're here for, there's a perfectly good hanging going on down the road. Everyone, you've got to wake up and ask your <laughs> Oh, you got the jester of the year right here. So you think you can jest? Well, let's step things up and see who's still laughing. <laughs> Is <this> <laughs> <laughs> Top already. <laughs> Is that Chester a wizard? the king shows a lack of all respect. Just as quick will toss you out. What did you expect? <laughs> Here 
there's another clown, they're the greatest in the town. If they don't entertain, we can flush them down the drain. When's the dragon eat the jester? I want to see the dragon. Dragon, dragon, dragon. <sighs> okay, now it's getting personal. If you think you can make a fool of me, it's time to switch it up! Show a vision of your fate. <laughs> your future don't look so bright now. <gasps> My brother Henry is going to be so jealous. Using the king at my expense. Well, too bad for you. I have ways of getting rid of jesters who are pests. 
Hush now, weary monarch, it's time for you to rest. We'll find a way to stop this jester passing every test. This music never fails to put the sleepy king out cold. You'll see in sleep his lever purling arm is uncontrolled. Hush now, little jester, the one I most despise. Don't make a peep, don't wake him up, you'll see he will be mine. It with your utter tomfoolery. You want to steal the spotlight from me? Well, you'll have to defeat me in a musical duel. <laughs> I bet you've never seen skills like mine before. Time to show us what you've got. I hope you can cry in tune. <laughs> <laughs> the jester is a musical genius. Why, he puts the bard's guitar to shame. Oh, yes, yes, the jester's so hilarious. Let's just ignore all the bard's hard work. Long live the new king. You have been ruler for three hours. The kingdom is in chaos and disorder. 
All of your people have come for your head. Defend yourself. You have been ruler for three hours. The hey, you know, I don't even get paid to do this. And generous until he gets the blues To stop the song is our job To keep the king amused For if the king is not amused His face will turn to red And should he lose his temper You will surely lose your head You must gather all your wits To amuse the king to bits Use the things that you can see To keep the king from misery Welcome back with your head still on your shoulders. <laughs> Quite a feat.
Oh, far out. Get ready to free your mind. Tell old Cosmo I said, Hello, honey town. me as supreme cosmic deity of this reality. Let's see if you're worthy. Use your teleport ability and follow me. We have a lot of work to do before I can hand over the reins. To start your training, we need to go through a cosmic gate. Place this Bon Jovi fruit on the altar to open the portal. Fruits and vegetables are a key to unlocking the universe, didn't you know? Now shoot through that chute and see what these dinky worlds have to offer. Yay! Before we can make you a god, you gotta master the mysteries. Behind each of these gates is a high concept knowledge bomb. If you master all four lessons, then you can replace me as supreme deity. I hope you can do it. I need a hardcore vacation, baby. I am not kidding. and I will teach you how to harness cosmic energy to create life. This poor Bon Jovi plant has died before its time. Let's bring it back to life. Hold out your mitts. Go ahead, reach for the light. You've got Reiki. Now, let me show you how it works. Put up both your hands and copy me. You have the gift of learning. I've never seen such rapid progress. Yes, your enthusiasm is Reiki wonderful. Yes, your enthusiasm is Reiki wonderful. You have the gift of learning. I've never seen such rapid progress. Yes. You have the gift of learning. Now you're a level one certified Reiki master. I don't know what to tell you. I've never used it in my life, but maybe you can or not. Don't worry about it. <laughs> Welcome back. Three more lessons to go. Your journey is just beginning, honey child. To be awesome.
awesome like me, you gotta let go of them shackles of material attachment. Look at this fool. He could have been a great dimension wizard, but his soul is trapped by things he possessed on the lower dink plane. What can I say? I love my things, but being chained to a toilet is not how I visualize my extra-dimensional wizard life panning out. I'm ready to give it all up. Let's see if we can help him out. Find the objects trapping him and capture them with this tractor weapon. My ring of wizarding. I thought you were my power source, but you just made people think I was married, which in turn made me forever single, which gave me more free time to study magic, but I could have done that anyway. Crystals, dummy! My favorite cereal box delivery truck. You're free to ride the eternal highway. Looking to keep your hill free? I used to love listening to hot jams, but now I realize that music appreciation is a waste of time. Thank you. of this wizard trophy, but I'm more than a wizard now. Down the duke shoot with you, my friend. What the? I'm no longer shackled to the upper deck of a john. Praise be. May the power of a thousand Molochs grace your travels. He's free to dimension up the universe now, and before, and also after. All thanks to you, my sweet straw Jomi. Two lessons down. You're halfway to sending good old Cosma to a recovery house in Florida.
ain't sad, but you're not special. You're a speck of dirt drifting along the wind of a fart. The world's so messed up, it's impossible to think straight. So don't even try. Just bury your head upside down in a pile of bad bananas. Then when you're done, come on down and take a sludge shower at Scum Spa. It's a lot of money, and we'll treat you like... Are you an out-of-work puzzler? Then we need you today. Just come on over and let me throw up in your face. Anytime, any place, I'm the... Have you ever wanted to be a Reiki certified Dink Master? Sign up for Cosma's Level 1 Workshop to Mastering the Dink. Now you are the Dink Master. Make a positive change in your community today. These bad rocks are jacking up my mode. This lesson will demonstrate how your actions affect the balance between dimensions. This cosmic scale shows if one world is crabbier than the other. Check it out. This green world moves, and it doesn't suck to live here. But if you look over here, this world stinks. It looks like a dried up puke bucket. Use these cosmic tools to tip the scales in favor of this dried puke pain world. Let's give them a taste of life. These bad rocks are jacking up my mojo, and I'm not yoked enough to break Swap! them. Swap! Swap! Keep going. Let's get this rope dripping cold on you, Craig. We need to fix everything on this side first. Hold on, hold on, you crane. We need to fix everything on this side first. Now we've tipped the scales in this world's favor. Now witness the horror of your dumb actions. Follow me, Duke Frame. Over here, Dink Master. See how our actions have caused this world to go full junk show? Each action has consequences. You can't just print new money and fix everyone's problems. That would break a hole in reality. For your final task, let's see if you can balance these two realms. Jomi keeps growing. I might believe Swap. in a higher power again. Swap. 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 Right, right. As the supreme deity of the cosmos, it is your job to maintain the balance. Wow! 
lesson left, baby. I got all my metaphorical eggs in your basket now. Don't go smashing my eggs when we're this close. Hear me, I'm Moloch, feed me your kids. Hear me, I'm Moloch, feed me your kids. Oh hey, sorry about all these Bon Jomies everywhere. I got way more than I could ever eat now. You should take one. You can make kombucha. I call it Bucci. the game or nothing but I'm not embarrassed of my chill life multiple goose are called geese but multiple moose are called moose fascinating simplest elements. Metal, fire, wood, water, and earth. There is absolutely nothing more to the material world than these five building blocks. Anyone who says otherwise is a low-level dink slave. As the supreme deity, it will be your responsibility to understand the relationships. water wet. Not such a mystery anymore. I feel like maybe I could call you my equal. This mystery, my darling mortal. I've never seen such rapid progress. You're the savior I've been squeezing my hands together for. There's just one last thing we gotta do before you become me.
train, you must be cleansed. Join me in my personal Jim Jilbong, baby. of material subsistence and reveal your cosmic self. Now you see me. I am the real you coming out of your pores. You can't get rid of me. I'm a part of you forever. Pretty gross, right? Just get it all out. Yeah. Keep sweating it out of your holes, that's good. You think you'll beat me, but I'll win in the end. I'm your sludge. I'll take over someday. You'll see. You're like a fresh pipe from the plumber flushing all the world's no-nos straight out. Now you're ready. Here, take these gauntlets. I won't be needing them anymore. job is done. Don't ask me what comes next. I'm going straight to my therapist. Crappy doo 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 gonna start a band, the end. If a Bon Jomi tree falls with nobody to hear it, does it make a sound? Why oh why? Multiple goose are called geese, but multiple moose are called... That's right, loser. Feed me. Wonderful. You've attained the knowledge you were seeking, Grasshopper. Wow. I've seen you grow from a heroic insect to a majestic king to an all-powerful deity. That's all the cards I have in store for you at this time, but you can always jump back in. Oh, if you ever want to start your journey from the beginning, just burn that book beside you. You know, the thing I love about sitting in front of fires cross-legged is that it just seems traditional, doesn't it? You know what to do with the card, right? Burn, baby, burn. the gate. Throw it into the fire if you're ready to leave for good. Hasta luego, mi friendo.